Finally got my first loot crate. Welcome to the Dave Cave. I, as always, am Dave. And today, you're probably wondering why I'm set back a little bit. And that is because we're doing my first unboxing video ever. Loot Freight Crate. It was due to me back in, like, May. Maybe June. I got this as part of a Father's Day gift from my wife. Loot Crate had a whole bunch of issues. A whole bunch of emails went out. They basically filed for bankruptcy. Got about $10 million more in investment. Like I said, a whole bunch of emails went out. But... Eventually, they're getting back on track, they're getting their shipments out, and finally, finally, I have my first loot crate. The theme for it is flesh and blood. I have no idea what the hell that's going to mean, but I'm pretty damn excited for it, so let's get this bad boy open. And yes, this is the knife I have down here. Leave me alone. First thing I open, ooh, ooh, I like this. First thing you see is a shirt. It's teal in color it is Bride. Oh, you can't hear me. Bride of Frankenstein. I love the shit out of that design. Love the color, the lightning. You see the bride, but you don't see the bride. You got Frank in the front. I love the hell out of that. That's a baller ass shirt. For me right there, that's worth the crate. I love it. Now I'm thinking about it, I don't know that this is flesh and blood. That doesn't really, well, maybe Frankenstein flesh, blood. Because I know one of the themes coming up is classics, and that seems to fit into that too. So let's keep digging and see what else we find. Oh, yeah, nope. Flesh and blood. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Yeah, this little guy, let's, let's get this bag. I'm sorry, this is going to be loud. He's so cute. Look at this guy. Doesn't squeeze, uh, squeezes, doesn't make any noise or anything like that. What does this thing say? It's Loot Crate, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, Loot Crate exclusive, a NECA company. There you go. Now I'm going to have to find a place for this guy up on here. Look out in the next video. He'll be somewhere up there. Moving along. I love this. So far, two for two. I'm loving this shit. Moving along. Ooh, there we go. Oh, man. You know, I wish I had had this. For my Friday the 13th reviews. Loot Crate. Look at that. Camp Crystal Lake. Again. This is going up. Got to find a spot. That's going up. I like that. Is that anything crazy? Simple? Blood? Flesh and blood. God. Three for three wins. Keep the party going. All right, what we got? Keep dropping stuff on this bag over here. Sorry. Next thing, the fog. Not the fog. The fog. Yeah, let me see if I can get this closer. Look at that. There you go. Decent. I dig it. Not a big pin guy, but I like it. I like it, I like it. Again, moving along. Oh, here we go. This is pretty baller. I like this. I can't figure out exactly what it is, but from The Shining. Oh, it's just a straight-up journal. Here, you know what? I get this. Hang on. All right. Get the plastic off. Throw the plastic over there. Yes, we know it's from The Shining. If you don't know it's from The Shining, you probably don't have much... Uh, Used for a loot fright box, but we gotta move it there. Look at that. Get the lighting right there. You go. Yeah, that's nice. I think it's just a straight up journal. Ha 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 ha. Yeah. Yeah. Man. Yeah, it's. I mean, I don't want to say it because the weight was very frustrating. This shit's worth the wait. It's just a straight-up journal, by the way. Sorry. I'm looking through. It's just a blank journal. There's not. It's just for putting stuff in. You know what? When doing my notes for reviews, this is what's going to be in for at least until I fill this bitch up. Man. 
such a good crate so far. I don't think we have much. We got a few things left. They're not big, but yeah. All right. What's this? It's a bookmark. The Lost Causes of Bleak Creek. A thrilling and darkly funny novel about two best friends fighting the sinister forces at the so heart of their southern town. Out 10-29-19. Pre-order now. Okay, so that's on the way here. Pause that if you want to read it. I just read it out loud for you. Hmm. Oh, it's from Rhett and Link. Those guys are awesome. Funny as hell. I'll have a link to their channel in the description below. They're fun stuff. Okay, moving along. Wow, there's... You know, they said there's going to be like three, four things. Maybe they're making up for lost time, but... Damn. Oh, and then here we go. I cut my finger. Son of a bitch. There we go. It's like Christmas. Come on. Come on. Amity Island, no swimming, beach closed, 1975. Again, got to find a spot on the wall for this. This is awesome. It's metal. It's flimsy, but it's metal. <sighs> yep. I'm loving every... I've, I've said it a bunch of times already, but I'm loving every thing that comes out of this crate. Ah! <sighs> Makes me so excited for the next one. Then one last little... Oh, two last little things. What is this? Oh, that was just a little puzzle. Get to work on your order assignment. Earthbreak.com If you know what this is supposed to be, or if I'm just missing something altogether, hit the comments let me know. Knock them out. Do your part at Earthbreak.com Maybe it's a game? Maybe? Oh, here you go. Earthbreak. From the makers of Haunted Killer is an immersive interactive story where you become a character in the universe. Do you have what it takes to survive the alien apocalypse? Bah, bah, bah. I'll check it out. Why the fuck not? And this last thing. It's another thing for the fog. Oh, here you go. It's a little description of what I just opened for all of you. Here we go. When it comes to horror, it's all relative. Join Luke Fried's one big stabby family as we celebrate crazed clans and bad broods with flesh and blood. Blood. Not bud, blood. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Funny plush, P-H-U-N-N-Y. Family that slays together, stays together. Pay homage to everyone's favorite cannibalistic clan. Debatable. With this Leatherface plush, a looter favorite past item. You'll receive either happy or sad Leatherface. What did I get? Oh, angry. <clears throat> sad. I wouldn't even say sad. That's angry. Grumpy ass leather face. Put you back in the crate. We'll find a home for you. Exclusive Jaws metal print sign. So a sheriff, a mean bro so a sheriff, a mean biologist, and a sea captain walk into a bar or boat. Take a bite out of Jaws with this Amity Island sign. Exclusive Bride of Frankenstein t shirt. She's alive. Wake up your wardrobe with this electrifying Bride of Frankenstein tea. Exclusive The Shining Journal. Channel your inner Jack Torrance minus the X murdering with this Overlook Hotel Ledger Journal. Just watch out for room 237. Exclusive, the fog pin. It's not the mist, it's not the swarm, it's the fog. Celebrate this John Carpenter classic with a pin featuring the ghost of Captain Blake. Artist, Benjamin Hall. Bonus, Friday the 13th, Camp Crystal Lake Pennant. A mother's, no, uh, a mother's love... Knows no bounds, especially when it's Jason's mom. Crazy bitch. Remember your time at Camp Crystal Lake with this past loot crate bonus item. There you go. Take, take a look at that. You ain't gonna be able to read that. What the fuck am I talking about? That's all the stuff I just read for you. Yeah. That was a good crate, man. I, I'm happy with everything that was in there. From what I've seen of other people doing unboxes of these crates, that's everything, by the way. That's. Yeah, let the face out of there. Empty. Out. 
done. Um, with these other crates that I've seen people open, not everything is a hit. I was expecting to have at least half of these things be something I don't know, but that's all good shit right there. And every single piece, at least that can fit up there, is going to go up there. I'm really, really happy with this. Flesh and blood? Yeah, definitely, definitely did it for me. And absolutely has me ready for the next one that's coming. I think the next one is Slaycation, which I would imagine is trips and such like that, which maybe I wonder if that's going to have a shining thing in that too. So be on the lookout for that. They say that that's going to be coming kind of like the end of October, early November. So I'm going to get that open. The day I get that, I'm going to get the video out, get that to you guys. So be on the lookout for that. And while you're waiting for that, I do reviews, I do reactions, I'm starting to get in a little bit more, you know, theories, discussions, stuff like that. I'll have links to a mix of that in the description below. Be sure to go check those out. I'm going to get out of here, go figure out places to put this up on the wall. Thank you so much, as always, for stopping by the Dave Cave. I will see you all real soon, but until then, take care.